Hello everyone, let's try to be a cheat code ninja today. In this problem, we have to do a pre-order traversal of a binary tree. In a pre-order traversal, we first go through the root element, then we repeat the same process for the left subtree if it exists. In our example, there is no left child of the root element, so we'll repeat the same process on the right subtree. So this element will now become our new root, we'll print its value and then try to repeat the same process if there is a left subtree. So this will become our new root and then we'll print its value. This node has no child element so we'll go back to the parent. So for node 2 we'll try to see if it has any right subtree. Since it doesn't have any right subtree we'll go back to its parent. And since this is the root of the whole tree we are done with our pre-order traversal. Let's look at a bigger example. We'll start with the root of the tree and print its value. Now we'll go to its left subtree and this will be the new root. So we'll print its value. Now we'll try to go to its left subtree and this will be the new root and we'll print its value. Since this node doesn't have any child elements, so we'll go back to its parent and try to look for a right subtree. This will be the new root and we'll print its value. Now we cannot go down any further, so we'll go back to its parent too. For node 2, we have covered both its left and the right subtree, so we'll go back to its parent node 1. Now we'll go to the right subtree of node 1 and this will be the new root. It doesn't have any left child so we'll directly go to its right child. We'll print its value and now we have covered all the nodes of the binary tree. For implementing the recursive solution, we can start at the root of the tree and store its value and then we can repeat this process for its left subtree and then the right subtree. We can also implement this iteratively using a stack. But one thing to be careful about is that for a stack, the last element is popped out first and since we want to access the left subtree first and then the right subtree, we must reverse their order in the stack by first adding the right subtree and then the left subtree. The time complexity of both the solution would be O of n because we have to access all the nodes once and for the space complexity, both our recursive call stack and the iterative stack can at most have the number of elements equal to the height of the tree. Let's implement both the solutions. Let's define a variable to store a pre-order traversal. Now we'll define our recursive DFS function. Now we'll write our base condition to check if we have reached a null node. In that case we'll return from the function. Now since we have ensured that our root is not null, we can append its value to our result. And now we can call the DFS function on the left subtree and then the right subtree. We are now done with our recursive function. We'll call it on the root element. And now our result list will be populated and we can return it. We are now done with our recursive solution. Let's implement our iterative solution. Just like our previous solution, we'll maintain a result variable to store our output. In this solution, we have to maintain a stack and we'll initialize it with the root. We'll keep on repeating this process till our stack is not empty. The last element of the stack will be our root element and we'll pop it. Since we are not checking whether our child elements are not null before adding them to the stack, we'll keep that check over here to ensure that we skip over the null elements. Since we have ensured that our root element is not null, we'll add its value to our result. We want to access the left subtree first before accessing the right subtree. So in our stack, we'll first add the right child and then the left child. And when we have accessed all the nodes in the tree, our stack will be empty and we can return our answer. We are done with our solution, let's submit it. You can see our solution is accepted. If you thought this video was helpful, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more such content. Thanks for watching.